Hello everybody, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch with a bit more Unreal Engine news. Now, if you were paying attention to the channel two days ago, Unreal just launched their online learning resource, The Academy, at available at academy.unrealengine.com. And basically, it was a um, consolidation of all of their online videos into a courseware format. Well, today they've gone one step further, and they've released basically a bunch of instructor guides. Um, and these are basically aimed at teaching people how to teach people how to use Unreal Engine. So basically, you remember back in school uh, where you would basically, your teacher would be teaching you a particular subject and they were following along with their teacher book and then you had your assignments and quizzes, etc. that all came with it. Well, this is the kit that, that would ultimately provide that. So this gives the, um, the teacher who's trying to teach people how to use uh, the Unreal Engine, the courseware, um, so basically the syllabus and then the quizzes, etc. that we required to effectively teach someone how to use Unreal Engine. And it's a very cool idea. Basically, this is aimed at educators. I thought Game from Scratch was borderline educational. In fact, I was actually kind of thinking that if I could adapt these to make a tutorial on it. So it might be kind of an interesting template for an upcoming Unreal Engine tutorial. And that's kind of where they're going with this. But I actually don't think I am legally allowed to do so. So I won't be going down that road, but I'm still going to show you what these materials are. These are especially useful if you are an educator. Um, but this is actually going to lead to a weird kind of catch-22. So if you're a lawyer type, I would love to hear your opinion on this. But these are released under the Creative Commons licensing. And that one means basically you can use them freely almost however you want. If you go to the summary here, the way you can use them, however, is limited to attribution. So you got to tell where the material came from and non-commercial international. Now, that non-commercial is very interesting because I think that means um, like in these videos, because I have monetization turned on, is that technically commercial? So that would make this courseware uh, unavailable to me. But even more importantly, if you're at a, an educational institution, you're paying tuition to be there, especially if you're at like a um, a game development course like Full Sail or DeVry or something along those lines. That's very much a commercial learning environment. So if you're not allowed to make any money, uh, you may not use this material for commercial purposes. Does that include commercial schools and does that include online tutorials? I'm not sure, actually. It's an interesting subject. I think it's um, it's kind of enough of a no-go for me that uh, I'm mostly just looking at these as a matter of curiosity, and I won't be actually going anywhere with these materials. But I don't know where that stands for people that are actually paid to educate, because that is technically commercial. So I, I would be interested to see what the limitations are there. But this is basically, again, full courses you can download from Unreal, Edu um, Unreal Engine site to teach people how to use Unreal Engine. We'll take a look at them in just a second. But this is going to prove to be quite niche for more pe most people. But I think there's some people that are definitely going to want to take a peek behind the curtains. And they may just find this useful, even though it's not technically aimed at you. Um, and you'll see here, right now, it's based on three different sets of instructor's guides. There's a course on VR cookbook or VR development. There's a generalized game development one. And then there is one adapted from the book Unreal Engine for Game Development in 24 Hours. Now, it is not the book. It is the course the book is based on. And I'll, I'll dig up that book. It's available on Amazon somewhere. I'll toss in, hey, I'll do an affiliate link. So if you buy it, I make a little bit of money. But truth of the matter is, I'm not recommending the book in any way, nor am I recommending against it. I, I have no uh, prior experience with it. But definitely, that's what the course is built around. Now, if you've never done a 24-hour book before, the title is kind of misleading and or it's quite literal basically they are teaching you 24 one hour lessons so it's not like in a day you're going to learn how to use unreal engine in 24 hours worth of teaching you may um, so it'll take a great deal longer than uh, a day to get through this book unless you suffer from some serious insomnia um, anyways those are the three primary teaching guides available each one weighs in between 200 and 500 megabytes in size as a download um, there's another one coming, or there's another two coming. One is for, and let me just bring that up. There's another one coming for uh, Unity developers. This guy right here, Unreal Engine for Unity users. That courseware is coming soon, as is one for design visualization, which is basically using Unreal Engine for you know architectural visualization, uh, commercial visualization, that kind of stuff. So for prototyping or selling your project in real world uh, design kind of stuff which is an area that Unreal Engine is definitely focusing on a whole lot more as of late. So what exactly do you get here? Well, you get three sets of zips. 
Let me just bring them right here. So you see there is the um, game development guide, the 24-hour guide, and the VR guide. Each one, as I mentioned, is between 200 and 500 megabytes in size. If you go inside of them, they kind of vary in what's there. So this first one, the generalized one, is broken into guides and lectures. Now, guides basically are teacher's notes. They're in Word format, and you can heavily edit. You know, it's, it's basically the, the prototype for your course and what you try to get across and how you should teach uh, how to use things. And it even, as you can see here, has handout quizzes that you can you know, hand out to your classroom to learn from. And then we go to the other side of this scenario. We've got a bunch of PowerPoint presentations, which basically is the course itself. And as you see, these are actually quite huge. Uh, but this is a step-by-step -step PowerPoint teaching all of the stuff that you were just quizzed on from the other side. So this is what you would basically show your class. And if you're interested in just checking this out, minus a teacher, um, this is the, the guts of the course. So if you just want to take the course yourself with no uh, nobody driving it or instructing you or anything, you basically just want to come in here and read the PowerPoint. And this is teaching you whatever the subject at hand is. And that's so that's the most straightforward one. That's the straight up ue4 guide on top of that we've also got the vr and the 24-hour one and i'll use the vr as an example you got basically the same stuff but it's split out so the lectures once again are a whole bunch of powerpoints teaching you on this subject but we've also got exercises quizzes tests um, terminology breakdowns and then the other part that's quite interesting is there's also some pretty in-depth project files so you can see here 240 megabytes worth of project files to go along with the VR stuff. Um, in some cases, the project files are actually available for download from Unreal Engine themselves. Um, yeah, so the different courses have different levels of materials. Obviously, it depends on you know what you're coming at them from. This, again, is 100% aimed at instructors looking to teach. And this is basically an all-in-one kit for people to um, you know teach Unreal Engine. Now, again... Uh, when I first saw this, I thought, oh, wow, this is awesome. It's open source. I can use this as the template for a tutorial series potentially, um, but it doesn't look like it works that way. But if you're a lawyer and you have an opinion on how that uh, Creative Commons non-commercial would work there, I'm also curious to what, what your opinion would be on uh, commercial schools using this material as part of their courseware. Because I think this that non-commercial clause actually really limits what you can do with this. Uh, but you know what, even if you're not a teacher, I, I'm sure Unreal aren't going to be extremely upset if you go ahead and download these courses and go through them at your own pace. Not what it's targeted towards, and there's a little bit of a white lie involved in downloading the stuff. But again, I don't think Unreal is going to be particularly perturbed how you learn how to use their product. The end goal here is to teach more people how to use Unreal Engine. So when I downloaded these, it didn't actually turn out to be exactly what I thought it would be, but I still found the material interesting enough that I figured I would do this video on it. So let me know, are you uh, taking an, or an Unreal Engine course coming up, or are you thinking about teaching people how to use Unreal Engine? If so, does this material look really uh, useful to you, or yeah, not so much? I'm interested to know in the comments down below. All right, that's it for now. I will talk to you all later. Goodbye.